Elgeo Marquette County, Kenya's best kept secret, is a county where we take pride in branding ourselves as a county of champions. We are actually champions in everything. World Marathon record holder comes from Elgeo Marquette. Name them from, from Ezekiel Kimboi, uh, Kipsang, Kimeto, Edna, Lona, they all come from this county. For every uh, championship that happens in the world, in each season, uh, it does not go without having one of our own uh, winning a title. It is located in the former Rift Valley province, its capital and largest town being Iten. The county is made up of three ecological zones, the highlands, escarpment and lowlands. The county, I think the, it's the only county uh, with unique features in, in Kenya. We have uh, three ecological zones, which are, uh, are the islands, uh, we have an Angin Valley and the Lower Valley. So you can experience three different temperatures within with a span of about half an hour. I believe all of this gives, uh, gives uh, this county the uniqueness. The county is extremely diverse and it has numerous tourist sites in the region ranging from sports tourism, nature-based tourism, cultural tourism, adventure tourism and agro-tourism. El Marquette County is a hub of sports tourism. It has given opportunity for rigorous training in Eten, Cap Target and Cap Sait, and the county has continued to attract athletes from far and wide. We have several Europeans or, or world um, athletes coming to train in our county at the high altitude uh, training center owned by one of our athletes called Lona Kiplegat. We've also seen the first lady come and train in El Marathon, and that made her even uh, finish the London Marathon. And we still encourage more people to just come experience what we have in El Marathon County. Just look for El Geo Marakwet and you see it coming up. If you enjoy a little adventure, try walking safari at the slopes of the Kerio Valley Escarpment to the caves, rivers and waterfalls within the Kerio Valley Escarpment. Part of this county is just amazing. It's beautiful and uh, the longest stretch of escarpment. It's about 100 kilometers or even more and uh, I, I think it's the only place in the world that you can find such an escarpment. Paragliding is a recreational and competitive adventure, sport of flying paragliders. Uh, the world record. Uh, but the uh, longest time a paraglider can stay there was broken in the Marakwet. The best ever uh, paraglider was in the air for nine hours, which is very unique for our county. <laughs>
The acacia vegetation gives an amazing view of the beautiful scenery of El Marquet County. The ancient irrigation furrows of Marquet bring the waters of Embobut, Embolot and Enau, among other rivers from the high Chiranganyi hills down the steep escarpment to the warm endoplanes around the small town. This is something which was done almost 400 years ago. Kiptebear Hill is a spectacular, huge, steep and rocky hill. It is believed that it fell from the skies and people from all races visit the place to see it to be able to get the story behind this unique hill. Kiptebear Hill has unique features such as a natural forest, forest canopy, fantastic viewpoint at the peak of the cliff and caves. It is a good picnic site, one that enables bird watching activities and mountain hiking. Rimoy National Reserve is unique because it offers breeding ground for elephants from as far as Turkana and Samburu. The elephants that are found at this game reserve are the single largest herd moving together. KWS has been taking care of the elephants uh, in the park, but it, it, it has not been opened up for the public to go and see uh, what we have. Rimoy has one of the largest elephant herd in, in, this, in this region. And after a feasibility study conducted by KWS, they actually said they are going to restock the park for us. For the last 50 years, it has never had any revenue to the county. And with that, we believe our county is going to earn a lot of revenue. The Kepler Church cave is unique with various compartments. It is believed that during the times of insecurity, the nearby community used to take refuge within the caves and it would accommodate a whole village and their livestock. So very many people. On your way to Chiblodge from Iten, stop at the Cologne viewpoint. You will see the amazing Torok waterfalls. It is most spectacular during the rainy season when a cloud of spray and mist rises from the forest below the falls. <laughs> Kureswa Hot Springs is located in Keio South. The hot water emanates from the hill and showers down into Kerio River. One can have a natural shower here. The beautiful scenery entails hills, rocks that changes color, and a cave that has several chambers, woodland vegetation, among other very spectacular scenes. Chabloch Gorge was formed as a result of Kerio River cutting down into hard ballast rock. When there is flood, the river increases tremendously in height and volume and carries a heavy load of fine, highly abrasive silt which grinds down into the riverbed. The locals here use the gorge for recreational activities. Ren Gorge has port-like ships. There is a steel bridge across the river which gives a fine vintage point to steer down into the gorge, particularly during the rainy season when Carrier River is a forming torrent pouring through the narrow passage carrying heavy load of stones, boulders and tree trucks. The Terrain Rapids has an amazing scenery for picnic and here you can engage in fishing with the locals. Chibara Dam is part of the tourist attraction within the county. The tourist activities here include bird watching, forest and nature trail, wildlife viewing and visiting of caves within the forest. And I believe now we are actually the county of champions in everything, including the scenery. Conservation and tourism go together. We conserve, we get the benefits. We would like people to go to our forests, have nature trails. This county is endowed with uh, a unique landscapes and we want to encourage people to come and trek. We want to encourage people to plan for camping. We want to encourage people to come and have major nature work. We want to encourage people to come for picnic sites and uh, where they can have excursions and uh, schools coming and having, uh, having fun in the, in the landscapes of this uh, county. 
The county has well-preserved rich in cultural heritage. This include artifacts, ceremonial attire, brass and copper ornaments, song and dances, acrobatics and traditional houses. Uh, culture is unique for every destination. And I believe uh, Elgeo Marakwet has a unique culture. Uh, we, are, we, we, we have initiatives now to, to, to establish a thought cultural center. We also have very rich culture, very rich culture. We still have um, our taboos. If you go to the lower part of the valley, like in Tot, you will get real uh, culture, the African culture, even the kind of food. Uh, apart from that, we also think about uh, empowering the locals. Because when we open like uh, our, our reserve, the, the locals must be empowered in issues of business, in issues of trade, so that they may be able to actually meet the market for the, for the tourists. Uh, one thing uh, I want to tell investors is that uh, Elgeo Marakwet is ready uh, for partnership. The county government is ready uh, to do business with any investor that comes to this county. I want to assure them that uh, the issue of marketing and also uh, ensuring that uh, they are in a good working environment will be done by the county. And I think it's the only county that has uh, that unique uh, uh, characteristics. And that's why uh, as a county we want to uh, uh, open up uh, this county to ensure that uh, people can experience uh, different uh, 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 things uh, in this country. I think uh, on issues of security, I want to assure them that uh, the safest place to be in Kenya now is Elgeo Marakwet County. We welcome you to Elgeo Marakwet County, the home of champions where amazing sceneries will make you stay here for longer, if not make it your home.